What's up guys, it's Fief Chief here, and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we're going to be showing you guys how to trade to 1 million coins part 3 on FIFA 19 Ultimate Team. So if you're enjoying the content, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what you guys want to see next. And we do have some packs at the end of the video for you guys, so make sure to stay tuned for those. So, what we're going to be doing today is showing you another trading method to trade to a million coins. Now, I know it's been a while, we're usually on these daily trading tip videos, but I had graduation party, a lot of family over, so I didn't really have time to do this for you guys. But now I can do it and show you the best way to make coins right now. So, this is a method that is going to work all year long because marquee matchups is coming out constantly. And it doesn't just have to be marquee matchups, it can be any SBC. So, what you're looking for is these SBCs that require a certain team, certain league, and which players are going to go up in price. So what you're going to want to look at is like this Juventus versus Inter SBC. You need a Juventus player and an Inter player, and they have to be probably gold because you need a 79 rated squad. So we're going to head on over to the transfer market and see how much of those players are actually costing right now. So I was doing this a little earlier. Juventus players do cost a little more than the Inter ones, I believe. So we've got a couple Juventus players here for 1200 Let's check. Yeah, about 1200 1100 they're going to sell for. So we're probably going to snipe them down to about 800 and you're just going to sit here and try and snipe all these players that are usually costing about the minimum price, but because this SBC, they're all going for about at least 1200 So you can sit here and snipe these guys, or you can set your bidding so you can bid on players so put that at about 1200 there are no players up for bid right now from Juventus they're getting picked up but if you were to sit here I don't really have a lot of time in the video if you were to sit here and just snipe these players you would pick them up left and right especially when packs are coming out or at one o'clock when people might be selling players to afford a new SBC so make sure to snipe these at the optimal time again usually one o'clock because something gets released and then the other team is Inter. We'll look at that real quick. I believe these are a lot cheaper. It might not work as well. Yeah, these are selling for about 900. You could probably sell these to lazy buyers for. So you want to snipe them for probably 600, which you'll probably pick up a lot of non-rares because people will just list them up for the minimum if you just sit here and snipe. Let's see if there's any for bid or if they're just getting picked up right away. All right, so there are Inter players. I actually messed up the event as one, so there are going to be players up for bid. But look at all these guys you can sit here and bid on and win them and then sell them on for 900 coins, winning them for 500 coins each. Let's head over, over to Juventus to show you guys. I realized that I had the minimum buy now set, not the maximum. So if we do check Juventus, yes, we, we can sit here and we can win guys for about 800 coins and sell them for 1,200. Look, look at all these guys that haven't been bid on. Let's put a bid there just to see what happens. So we're going to move on to the next SBC and show you guys another way to make coins right now. Now, I did not check this one before. Actually, no, I did early on today. I tried to do it when I did the Juventus versus Inter. It didn't work as well, but it still kind of works. If It doesn't work as often, I would say. It is the Spurs versus Manchester United. So again... As you can see, it requires a player from Spurs or Manchester United, two of them, so either club. So you're going to be looking for Spurs and Man United players. Again, probably gold because you need a 78-rated team. I checked these leagues. They didn't go up at all, the Chinese Super League and the MLS. It doesn't require a certain team, so typically the players don't go up as much. And then we're going to check the Spurs and Man United SBC for you guys here see how that would work for trading and I'll let you guys know so we're gonna set this to Premier League we'll head to Man United first let's see how much these players are selling for I'd say probably 1100 they're going for perfect about a thousand they're going for so this is actually a good one to do because there's quite a few non rare players for Man United so we'll probably set this at about 750 and you can just sit here and snipe or you can set your bid to about 750 your max bid and just bid on every single player. As you can see, there's a lot of players you can pick up here. Let's just go through real quick. We've got Jones, Romero, Lindelof, Shaw, Smalling, Bailly, Fred, Darmy, and right there's eight players that you can pick up for this minimum price. There we got Jesse Lingard, nine, Mata, ten. So there's 
double digit players you can pick up from Man United. And again, another huge one you can get players constantly and make bitcoins. Spurs, I know there's a lot of non rare golds. I don't think I don't think the price is gonna be very high. Again, about a thousand coins. It's not this is a good marquee matchups for trading. Probably set that to about seven hundred. Again, you'll sit here and snipe, keep refreshing the market, and players will eventually show up. Or you can go over here and bid on all of these players and hope to win some. Again, the higher rated players will go for more because there is a rating requirement. So, I mean, maybe I'll just drop a few bids because he's 80 rated. I'll actually make some quick coins off of this while you guys are watching. So that is one there. And then I believe I wanted to talk about the marquee matchups itself. It is great value. This is always something to look at. Even though you can trade with it, this is a high value marquee matchups. You're getting two rare Electrum player packs, which are... I believe better than 45k packs, not as good as 50k packs. So I'm going to value them at 45,000 coins, just for sake. So that's 90k right there. These packs, pretty much worth nothing. You're never going to get anything good. But these, all these teams are super easy to complete. These two teams right here at the top, going to cost you about, at the max, I want to say 4,000 coins each. At the absolute maximum, you might have players in your club, untradeables, bronze pack method players just sitting around and then down here just super easy all you need is gold players really chemistry isn't super high so you just need some players from the same league max six really easy one to complete and then it's pretty much the same thing over here so you're gonna get about 150 to 175 thousand coins worth of packs here just from this SBC and then I guess I'll jump into the packs here for you guys that we have saved. So that was the trading method, using the live SBC to make easy coins. That's how we're going to be trading to a million coins on FIFA 20, so stay tuned for that. We're going to start with the worst packs here. We're going to go into the premium gold pack. If we don't get a walkout and it's a bad pack, we're probably just going to skip past it. Let's see. Is that? No, because it's not a promo pack. That won't be boards. And at this point in the game, I've just been storing stuff to club that I don't have and then quick selling the rest because I'd, I'm just not too worried about my coins anymore. I, I'm pretty experienced in trading, so we can just build that back up quickly. And as we're opening these, I will tell you guys, I did do the footies Kyle Walker, so you'll see him in my Man City team as we get a boards player here. Absolutely huge pickup. Nacho Fernandez, not a bad card. 83 rated players will always take. The Kyle Walker, I get so many untradables from my foot champs and division rivals rewards this week that I got like a Fernandinho, I got a Fabinho, I just got to throw all those guys in. I actually did it for about 50k, it was super nice. And I used both of the red players I got. I got 93 Tellez and 93 Pizzy. So I got to put those guys in and it was 286 rated squads, so they made it super easy. We have a walk out here, be a team in the season. We do get a team in the season. Be a big one. Come on. Oh my gosh. Costa Rica, I think. That is not what we want. 86 rated. He's probably going to be about 13k. That's not really what we want to see, but that wasn't a great pack. I'm pretty... Oh no. This was. This is the pack that trolls people. They think they have a 100k pack, and it sounds like it, but it's just not. It has all these non-rare players in it. But we're going to check here as we get a game clip for a high-rated player. We're going to check his price. He's probably about 13k, as I said. Maybe a little higher. Maybe Yeah, he's going to be 14k. So, I mean, it's decent. We'll list him up later. Quick sell the rest of this. Here we're into the big packs. We have three rare Electrum players packs and a rare players pack. Here we go, the big four packs. Again, we do have the Kyle Walker on our team, as I was saying. Well, here I go again. We're going to stop because we got to walk out. Is that a normal gold player? It is. Spanish Cam Isco? David Silva! The Man City man himself as we're talking about the team. The old man's walking out. Look at him there. We do get Kyle Walker in the team for about 50k for his footies card. And then we pack 89 David Silva from the packs. So these packs are from, five of them are from Marky Matchups, two of them are from the Kyle Walker SBC, which actually, great SBC, I recommend doing it. So there is 89 rated David Silva, he's probably going to be going for a ton, 
as a Premier League Spanish 89 rated player. What else is in the pack? Again, I was talking about these Rare Electric Players packs. They're incredible. Maybe we'll get 32k out of them. Let's see here. There's one listed for 33, so it's probably going to be about 31 and a half. But that is a big pickup. We're probably going to list them for right around that. Just get our coins back. So Kyle Walker, we're almost we're getting him for pretty much free into the club. His footies card. And then I don't really do it at this point in the game, but always check your silvers. They they can go for quite a few coins. That's why I believe these packs are better than the. 45k prime electrum players because these rare silver players a lot of times will go for a lot of coins I don't want to bore you guys with doing that. We're gonna keep jumping into the packs Which is what you want to see quick sell the rest of it another rare electrum players pack. Here we go. Come on Another walkout here we go. It's a team of the season. Come on be an ultimate team of the season Portugal right back. Oh, no I hate seeing Portugal like that. But th that's a great card. 90 rated, almost in the hole at club, just missing that shooting. Low pace for a right back, but he'd be a great sub. Great sub to put in there. So let's see what else we have in here. We can 84 and 83 rated. Again, guys, these rare Electrum players packs are huge. See, he's probably about 34K, Andre Almeida. We'll sell them for 35 actually. That's a nice pickup. Again, we're making huge coins off of marquee matchups here. We're just going to list him up. And you guys know 84s, 83s. Any important 82s are going for a ton of coins right now. So make sure to sell all of yours. What I mean by important 82s is good nation, good league. Just anyone that people need for SBCs. So we'll just kind of, like a Danny Alves. He's a really good one. Danny Alves, I think we can sell 3.5k probably. We'll list him up like that, just see if he sells. Again, these silver players will probably sell like the MLS guy, but don't want to bore you guys with that. We have some more packs. Let's get one more walkout out of these last two packs. Hopefully we can pull something big. Come on, EA. Another walkout! I told you guys, these packs are insane. Rare Electrum Players packs. Here we go. CDM, I believe it's Matic. You have 86 rated. We'll take it, though, out of another Rare Electrum player's back. There we go. Another huge pickup there. Some easy coins to get into the club. Another 83-rated player that we can sell for about 3K. Matic, we're just going to list up for about open bid, pretty much. I don't really want to waste your guys' time checking how much he sells for that much. And then Gustavo, we can sell. I hate how they changed his picture. That is just terrifying. His old picture was much easier to look at. <laughs> All right, guys, we have the last pack for you here, 50K pack. Let's see what's in it. Another walkout, please. No walkout to end the video, but I believe we got three or four straight walkouts from that. So make sure to drop a like for that. Here, we're going to end with a Castilejo, I believe. Yes. Another good player to sell. But if you guys are enjoying the content, you enjoyed the trading tips, and these insane packs that we just got, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what you guys want to see next. Thanks for watching.